Hey guys, I'm back. <laughs> back and looking crazy. <laughs> It is too late, but today we're going to see how I do my washing goes, okay? I like to do them at night because I don't like walking around with hair. But uh, this is a week old, so I'm going to use my favorites to wash. And then you're going to see me use the Aussie product line Miracle Curls, which be having your girls' curls popping. Um, yeah, y'all going to see me do my washing goes. And no, you cannot get in the shower with me. Uh, we're, we're not doing that over here. Not over here, okay? So. Okay guys, so this is what we're starting with. After I shampoo in the shower, getting that product build up off my roots, I use a ton of conditioner um, to coat my hair and finger detangle. This is important to make sure your hair is smooth. Once I'm out the shower, I usually use my microfiber towel while I'm getting dressed and doing my skincare routine. And it soaks up a lot of the moisture so that my hair is not dripping wet. Alright, so if you've been a part of my channel, you know I love to do my four sections, no matter what the style is, for detangling. It just makes the process easier. I also am a faithful oil user for stimulating growth on my scalp. I know y'all are ready to see what these Aussie Miracle Curls is going to do for your girl. I only use these four products, and I'm going to give y'all the order in which I do it. Okay, let's go. The first product I use is the Curl Defining Oil, and it really makes my hair soft. I like using that before I detangle. I then go in with the Detangling Milk. This just silks up your hair, girl, and like literally makes it slip. So that brush is just running through it. Now, I have noticed that this new brush, I don't know what the name of it's called, but it is the truth for detangling curls and coils, okay? The third product I use is the Frizz Taming Cream, and I really like how it penetrates my curls. I mean, it keeps it conditioned, and it really softens it. So now for the main event of the styling pretty. Once I have my hair pretty smooth, I then take my finger and do ringlets of hair i don't know how to explain it but you're gonna see so i'm basically just wrapping my finger around the hair making sure it's smooth but i'm doing big sections this is what i have noticed has made my curls last longer in my washing go again it's really important to make sure that the hair is smooth because that's going to limit it from tangling and also just it's going to be popping more. So once I do that I like to scratch the curls a bit and we on to the next section. Going back to number one. try the Aussie Miracle Coils collection. Um, I only did a couple wash and goes with it, but I didn't like how crunchy it made my hair. That's why I reverted back to just doing the Miracle Curls because my hair stays soft even after it dries. <laughs> section I'm gonna slow it back down for you guys and it's really simple you're just detangling and defining your curls really I like doing the bigger sections um, and I'll separate them once they all dry but I like for them to dry big because it separates nicely kind of like when you do a bantu knot out or flexi rods <laughs> have is if you have curls that aren't curly right or hair that's straight you can wrap it around your finger and it will dry and define nicely 
you can even do your whole head like that um it just takes more time so i like to follow the natural curl of my hair just by wrapping it around my finger this is how much shedding i have from the shower and the whole process like that was it um so pretty good after that, I wrap it up, put it in a pineapple, and we on to the next day. My hair is about 90% dry now, um, so this is where I kind of shape it, stretch it. It's the perfect time to like stretch your curls because the curls are already defined, they're already set. So I don't know about y'all, but I like my hair big. And I pick it out, pick it out, pick it out. Now for me, my hair gets bigger by the day. So by day two, three, four, my hair is really big. My first day is the calmest it will be for the week. Once you picked it out a bit, this is the time to separate some of those curls so I like to oil my hands and just separate as much as you can I will say like the more you keep your curls together the longer it'll last but I do separate some Let me know what you're thinking if you try out this method how it works for you comment below if you've ever tried Aussie miracle curls this is how it turned out when it was dry on the first day and by the second day it did get fuller and bigger so at night I just pineapple my hair in a scarf and it lasts me for a week thanks so much for watching and be sure to like comment and subscribe see you guys next time